God's gift. In this episode, we can go through how my mom came into God. Last month, we went through my papa's life. If you didn't watch, link is in description. Do watch. Now, come to my mom's life. My mom's mother and papa, that is my grandpa and grandma, were CSA Christian. The first child born to them was my mother. Including my mom, they had three children, my uncle and my aunt. After six months of my aunt born, they found a swell in my aunt's head. So they took the child to Trantra Medical College Hospital. Their doctor said, the swell was hard like stone. Its throat may be up to brain, so it is risk to do operation. Child may live or may die. If the swell become some water in a fluid, we may do something. So my grandpa and grandma were in deep worry. At that time, one person said about a old aged Pentecostal pastor, Go there and pray and your child will be all right. So they took my aunt to church. My grandpa was not much in God, so he stood outside the church. My grandma prayed with pastor and brought a prayer oil, and they applied oil regularly. Within two months, they found good change. The stone, like swell, became fluid. They again brought the child to hospital. The doctor was surprised and he said, It's really good. Do what you did earlier. Do that medicine. Due to this, my grandparents became happy and they continued going to church and took baptism. My grandma took baptism without removing jewels. My mom too loved to wear jewels. So my mom would wear my grandma's jewels to school. When my mom was studying in eighth, they found a swell in the back of my mom's neck. When they went to the doctor, they said the swell should break by itself. If we operate sometimes, there may happen some damage to veins. As days went, my mom suffered from eye and ear pain. She couldn't even eat or drink. So my mom promised it to God, I will remove all my jewels. Within two weeks, the swell has went. My mom started to eat and drink. Then my mom gained Holy Spirit and baptism. My mom completed 10th, 12th and diploma. Then she worked in a hospital. In our life too, we would face some sufferings. It's nothing but to shape us and to draw us near to God. Continuation of this will be on next fourth week. In that episode, we can see how my mom and my papa get married. Thanks for supporting us. If you like our video, like, comment and share. And don't forget to subscribe our channel and press the bell icon to receive our videos regularly. God bless you.